and a beautiful day to you. I hope you're having a great day. Now today, I'm going to take you to the Philippines. And we're going to go to the central Visaya, almost in the middle of Philippines, and explore the island of Bohol. <laughs> Getting to Bohol, there is a regular fast ferry service from Cebu City to Tagblaren. Ocean Jet have several ferries every day. The journey only takes two hours and costs 800 pesos for general deck or 1000 pesos for the business class deck per person one way. On arrival at Tagblaren, you will need transport to your accommodation. There are taxis, trikes, and there's even a place to uh, rent a motorbikes at the port, which leads us to the next point. Where do you stay on Bohol? Now, by far, the most popular reason for visiting Bohol are its beautiful beaches. And the best beaches are found in the south, down here on Panglao Island. Now, when you arrive at Tagbalaran, it's about a 40-minute trike taxi ride to Panglao. And I recommend staying as close to a loner beach as possible. Not only is it a lovely and lively beach, but from here you can organise everything that there is to do on Bohol Island. During the day, you can relax on the beach, get a massage, take a boat trip, have a swim and enjoy a drink. And after sunset, the beach and surrounding area lights up with cafes, bars, restaurants and entertainment. Find a taste to your liking and enjoy. Once you're settled in, Everything else on the island you can do in a day trip from Panglao. One of the more famous things to see are the chocolate hills. These are limestone hills that dot the landscape around Carmen. In the summer, the grass on these hills turns brown, making them look like balls of chocolate, like you're inside a box of Ferrero Rocher surrounded by chocolate hills. Next up is a visit to see Asia's smallest primate, the sleepy tarsia. An endangered species, these tiny nocturnal creatures are now being protected in sanctuaries where you can admire these cute animals. They are very sensitive to light and sound, so there is no camera flash permitted and you must remain as quiet as possible while admiring these miniature primates. For those who want to relax and watch the landscape glide by, there are the Lobok River cru Cruises. A two hour buffet lunch included cruise down the Lobok River through the heart of Bohol, while you admire the passing scenery. Be aware though, these are quite large boats and they're shared with other tourists and often have a singer on board to entertain you. Don't expect a peaceful quiet trip but do expect an entertaining one. For a more relaxing day, you can organise boat trips to some of the surrounding islands, like Virgin Island or Balakase Island. Both make great day trips. Scuba diving is also available, with several dive shops along Alona Beach organising dive trips to the best reefs around the island. Any Instagrammers will want to head to the man-made forest near Bila, a two kilometer stretch of tall mahogany trees tower up and over the road, creating a beautiful and very photographic scene. You can walk amongst the trees and breathe the forest air, and of course, take that compulsory selfie under the green canopy. If you don't mind leaving the fresh air behind for a little while, visit the Hingangdanan Cave, a beautiful limestone cave where shafts of light pour in from the holes in the ceiling, illuminating the pools of water below. There is an illuminated path down into the cave, but it can be slippy, so take care. If you're happy to rent a motorbike, then I can highly recommend going on your own adventure tour to explore the island and its daily life. There is lovely scenery to admire, and the local people are always friendly. Go off the tourist trail and you will find villages, churches, rice fields and local life to explore. While these are some of the main attractions of Bohol, there are lots of other things to see and do around the island. 
there are several lovely beaches along the south coast. And depending on your personal interests, here's a list of other things that you can do on Bohol. What do you think of Bohol? Amongst the many beautiful islands to visit in the Philippines, will it make your list? Let me know in the comments below and tell me where you would like to visit. If you enjoyed the video, remember to give it a like for me and I will see you somewhere around the world.